Omaha's weather leader, meteorologist Matt Surwe, with your accurate weather now forecast. Light rain continues early this morning. Now it's basically from about Maple South across Douglas County, Sarpy County, pretty widespread light rain. No lightning with this, no heavy rain, but you can see it extends all the way back through the I-80 corridor toward Lincoln and down toward Crete and Beatrice, and all this is pushing off to the north and east. So we still have a few hours here where we could see a little bit of light rain across eastern Nebraska, including in the Omaha metro. The main line of heavy rain and thunderstorms pretty much out of our viewing area. Still some uh, downpours of rain between about Bedford and Creston and Adams County and some heavier pockets of rain up toward Carroll. But look at where we saw some heavy rain. The green indicates three quarters of an inch to an inch and a half. One little line down to our south, another one off to our north. But it's really Harlan, Woodbine, where it looks like one to three inches of rain was uh, possible overnight. Some isolated two inch totals in southwest Iowa. Zooming into the metro here, look at the difference. There was one little pocket of heavy rain. If you live within a mile of I-680, you've got over a half inch of rain early this morning. Outside of that, maybe a tenth to a quarter of an inch. Not enough. You're still probably going to need to run the sprinkler early this morning. As far as storm reports go, not too many. A couple of limbs down around Oakland uh, or uh, Lyons and parts of Burke County and then another report of some wind damage in Gage County. So that first line of storms has pushed through, but we still have a cold front off to our north and west. And when this comes through later on today, they'll probably not be as widespread as what you're seeing across South Dakota, but we do have the chance of seeing some more isolated thunderstorms. Temperatures are in the mid to upper 60s north of Omaha right now. Low 70s for a lot of us down to our south. Dew points, yeah, we'll start to see those dew points climb again back into the upper 60s and around 70 today. So it is going to be an uncomfortably humid day, but a little nicer tomorrow and Tuesday. I want to see that humidity come back on Wednesday. So scattered light rain through about 8 o'clock this morning. By noon, mostly sunny with midday temperatures in the low to mid 80s. Here comes the cold front. Notice the window in Omaha between about 3 and 6 o'clock. Maybe a quick moving thunderstorm around here. So if you have afternoon plans, go for it. Just keep an eye on the radar. Temperatures topping out in the upper 80s to around 90 degrees. Those isolated storms push south and east this evening. 10 o'clock, we're in the upper 60s and low 70s. And then tonight, we really feel that push of cooler, drier air. Maybe a couple of light rain showers to our south. But then more sun on Monday and look at that down to 74 for a high 83. Still comfortable on Tuesday with maybe a thunderstorm to our north late in the day. And then we do get hotter low 90s Wednesday and Thursday. It looks like Thursday and Friday are going to be a couple stormy days coming up later this week.